2018 midterm season with control of the House hanging in the balance. Results in California could reshape the November election, so the stakes could not be higher. And Peter Ducey is live in San Diego. Peter. And Dana, this is California where people spend hours a day in their car because there's really no way to get around. And so they have here in San Diego essentially drive through voting. People have been pulling up in their cars, and this is the first time in the last hour or so that we've been here that there has not been a car or a motorcycle or an Uber with somebody inside dropping off a ballot. Uh, but we've got one coming on down just so that you can see how it works. Essentially, the county sends you your ballot, and then you can come here and drop it off just so that you can watch somebody take it into custody. So we've got a winner here in a blue Mitsubishi just dropping off the ballot. Mm -hmm. Drive through like you're at the In-N-Out Burger down the street, and that's it. And you still get the sticker that says that you voted today. So that is a very California thing on this primary day. Mm -hmm. uh, but that is not the only way that people are voting by mail. We're told that about, and they just handed me this, uh, over a million people are expected to vote by mail in San Diego out of 1.6 million, uh, at some point this year, out of 1.6 million. But with this primary, they think they're going to get a 40 to 45 percent turnout, which is much higher than the 27 percent turnout that they got last time. And I am hoping that somebody's going to tell me if I'm going to walk backwards into something. Yeah, I don't want you uh, to, I do I want want you you to walk over that dog. <laughs> Yeah, uh, but we have seen a steady trickle in here so far today, Dana, and we haven't seen any need yet for them to uh, have these stanchions. There hasn't been a long line of people that have showed up. Again, people are really just doing the drive through voting thing, but that's not all. They have something here in California now where you can register to vote today and then cast a ballot. So that is what is happening over here. These people are at the registration desk. Mm -hmm. They can sign up to register and then they can cast a ballot and it counts conditionally. And then you've got some other folks over here. But Peter, is that, Peter, if I can interrupt, is, is that somewhat controversial, allowing people to register and vote on the same day? It is, but it is something that you can see a lot of people are taking advantage of. This is where there are as many people as anywhere at this, the mm -hmm county location. So we're told that uh, they have a steady trickle here during the day because a lot of people choose to go to their precincts. Uh, but anybody that lives in San Diego can come here to vote. And we're told uh, after the polls close, all those precincts close, mm -hmm. all those ballots come here. So there's going to be a lot of activity here uh, in this jungle primary where the top two candidates in every race advance, whether they are Democrats or Republicans. So there could be in some races, two Republicans yeah. advancing or two Democrats. Yes. It's a jungle, That's, which is also very controversial. And we're going to talk about that with our panel in just a moment. But let me just ask you one other thing. You said that California is expecting a lot of mail-in ballots. So tonight's, well, today's primary is so important for determining the control of the House in this year's midterms. But is it possible that because of all these mail-in ballots that we won't actually have the final results tonight because they'll have to count those in the weeks to come? It is. In fact, a political operative that I was talking to in Washington was complaining or joking that they had two late nights in a row in Washington where they watched these results. Last night because the Stanley Cup game with the Capitals went really late. And tonight because not only uh, is everything three hours behind where all the people that spent the money on this race are watching from in Washington, but also just because it takes a long time for these things to come in and for them to be counted, especially mm -hmm. if you have to start opening a couple hundred thousand pieces of right. mail. All right, Peter Ducey, you got the best assignment of the day. We appreciate you being here. So the Los Angeles